We've been saying from the beginning that there is no place for profit in the care of our seniors. The NDP trying to put an end to for-profit long-term care homes. And they want to start with facilities like this one, Rivera, a federally run chain of long-term homes. And this Rivera is owned by the federal government. The prime minister could immediately fix this. The federal government appoints the board members for Rivera. This is absolutely within the control of the federal government. Long-term care homes have been devastated by the COVID-19 pandemic, accounting for the majority of deaths at the hands of the virus. Although the homes fall under provincial jurisdiction, the NDP wants the government to start the process with its own federally owned homes. It's a matter of principle for Singh. First and foremost, we know that profit has a means to one of two things. Either you cut the quality of the care or you increase the cost. But eliminating all for-profit care homes would be a daunting task as they make up more than half of all homes in some provinces. This advocate admires the idea but believes it will require at least some help from the federal government. So yes, we need national quality care standards and we need a regulator that rigorously oversees those standards. We need federal money to be tied to that. Singh bringing his demands to the House of Commons. Knowing that the worst conditions were in for-profit homes, does he still believe the federal government should be in the business of for-profit long-term care homes? We cannot turn a blind eye to this, and I very much agree that all options need to be on the table when we think about how we run, operate, and regulate our long-term care facilities in the future. In Ottawa, Nigel Newlove, City News.